Hello everybody, this is Drew and Alan. previously on Wind Waker. Uh, we didn't really do much because I'm bad at jumping. But, oh, as you can see, I am bad at jumping. <laughs> anyway, we were sent back to um, Windfall Island because the pirates said that there was something. Can't be too close right now. That's about as close as I can, that's about as far as away as I can be. Oh, okay, so Orca's telling us about finding Knight's Crest. Oh, and we get a red rupee, that's nice. But I don't need it. We overheard the pirates talking about something, but we have to go back to- Oh, they were trying to steal the bombs, so we have to go- Can we go in here? There's nothing of interest in that area, so we remove that part. So they were- the pirates were talking about- They had a bunch of bombs, and now- we're gonna go try to get the bombs from there that they stole. So. Last time I was really bad at jumping. Okay. Sometimes Link is too helpful. So we have to jump across this. We have to swing across here. I'll jump ahead when I'm done. Ugh, that was close enough. Oh, that's weird. It registers us as being on the Great Sea. Is that usually how it works? I've never noticed. Yep. <sighs> ah. yep. Okay, so I just skipped that one. Oh. Oh, I finally did it. What? You gotta be- you did it already? Yeah, I know, a whopping, um, three months. Yeah, that's definitely a short amount of time. You're- you're incredible. This isn't good. I've never, uh, even passed this test. How could he do it so quickly and make it look so easy? Well, you see, there's this thing called video editing. And if I give this to him, everyone will know for sure. Oh, I'll be busted. Uh, okay. You're the best Swabby of all time, so I guess I'll just give you the bombs. Go on, take them. Just don't tell anyone, okay? I'm serious, really serious, okay? Okay. <laughs> Hurry. Hurry up and take it. I'm serious. Grab it and get out of here. Someone might come. Hurry up, Swabby. Okay. Nope. You got bombs! Bombs? You can carry up to 30. Uh, pull one out and then press A to throw it or R to set it at your feet. Try it out. It's a blast! For only $49.99. Using bombs while on your boat gives you a mighty cannon that you can use to fight off seagoing enemies. Set them to and use them with Y, Z, or X. As every item is. That's mighty courageous. That's, that's mighty courageous of you. Trying to steal treasure from pirates. I suppose I should be shocked, but I'm more amazed that you managed to survive after being tossed out of that tower. From the look on your face, I have to guess you haven't saved your sister yet, huh? You don't give things much thought, do you? You just rush in, never thinking how badly things could go for you. Yes, that's Link. Like just now, the only reason why you got what you did was because we left a simple-minded rat 
little rat like Nico behind to look after things. No, no one else would have par would have parted with our treasure so easily. I assure you. And just how do you intend to use those bombs anyway? Don't tell me you're going after Jaboon's treasure too. Right now, Jaboon is hiding in a cave at the back of the island you're born on. But the entrance is blocked by a giant stone doorway. You can't get in without breaking down the door. We're going to relax in town and eat our fill of whatever this town has to offer. But we'll be leaving for outset first thing in the morning. If you want to manage to find Jaboon tonight, then I guess you win. But if you take too long, we'll come sailing right by you, you tomorrow morning. And believe me, you didn't get all of our bombs. You'd better be quick, kid. Okay. Whoa, awesome. You have a stone just like the one that Miss Tetra has. Why, yes I do. Hey, how do you use that thing? Can you talk to Miss Tetra through that? Man, you're so lucky. Do you see anything else? Oh, if you give me that stone, I'll be your swabby. I swear I will. Come on, please. Please give me that stone, please, I'm begging here. Does he say anything else? Nope. Mm, sorry. This is how I um, get important plot points. Now that we've gotten the bombs, that's part of the episode complete, which is good because I kind of need them to get something else done, you know? Yeah, let's let's -a go. Oh wait, we have another mail letter. Already, that was like, oh, uh, well, I guess 16 minutes. Oh, notice from Beetle Shop Ship. It's time for a semi annual big chance extravaganza. We have a new pro product that has burst onto the scene bombs. Ha, ah, burst. We're having an extra special sale on this choice item for a limited time only. You'll know where to find us by checking the enclosed Beetle Shop Ship chart. Oh, so this is when you get it. Visit a Beetle Shop Ship near you today. Offer not available in all regions. Don't miss this huge opportunity. That's actually pretty good because it's important to know where Beetle Shop Ship is for later on. It actually changes uh, from time to time. Oh, whoops. Well done. Our preparations are complete. If what the girl says is true, the pirates won't be leaving until morning. We must uh, meet with Jaboon and get the pearl before him, from him before they arrive. Let us delay no longer, Link. There's no time to waste. So let's fly. Wait. So let's fly. Let's fly away this way. But. We need to go over here. I'm gonna go back to... Wait. Oh, I didn't know that you could actually pause the game and check the songs when you're composing a song. That's nice. Well, I'm gonna go right to outset. See you back here. See you there. At outset, there's so much sailing in this game. Okay, now we have to go over here. Got to redirect the wind real quick. We're getting pretty close to Outset Island, so I need to go in this direction. Southwest. Oh, oh, we actually are. I got confused. So we should be at uh, Outset really soon. I think that's it. Yep, this is Outset right here. I'm just going to um, start the video back up right here because there might be a cutscene. I don't know. I assume there's a cutscene. Wait a minute. Yes, I have everything I need. 
Yep, this is outside. I'm just gonna get a little more wind speed. Yes, because this is definitely 100% realistic. Yeah, okay. See, it's nice that the game gives you, automatically gives you outside island. I think it does anyway. I don't know about any of the other islands. Yep, here's the cutscene. Hmm, it's still dark. Have you noticed, Link? Morning has not broken since we arrived at Great Fish Isle. Yes, it's been dark for three months, which is actually not unusual in some parts of the world, like above the Arctic Circle in some areas. The land that was so ravaged by monsters it is as if time itself is frozen. Perhaps this is the curse that Valu spoke of? Whatever the reason, if this night does not end, then we need not worry about the pirates overtaking us. In fact, it might not be a bad idea for you to v visit your hometown and family again after such a long time away. We can speak with Javoon after you do. So, oh, okay. Here's a uh, beetle right there. So the first thing we want to do is... No, that's not moving. It's going to say, if this mailbox is moving, then uh, the mail carriers are uh, doing a lot of work. Our grandma isn't doing so well in here. Uh, Link, Arrow, don't go. Don't leave, uh, don't leave your poor old grandma all alone. Uh, mm -hmm. Okay, this did work. I always get worried when it goes, or the fairy goes around Link. So we have to use the fairy on Link's grandma, and then she'll feel better. Oh, Link, is that you, Link? Grandma is always happy to see your bright, shining face. Link, my dear sweet Link, you're safe. That's wonderful, just wonderful. Did you do this? Did you heal me? Oh, you're such a sweet child. Oh, that's right. You and your sister Errol are trying so hard to be strong, and I've just been sitting here, moaning and worrying. I'm your grandma. I'm the one who should be taking care of you. I'm so sorry, Link. I haven't even considered what you must be going through. I'm a terrible grandma. Link, this is all I have to give you right now. You can keep it in your empty bottle. And we get... You got the elixir soup. This healthy soup that your grandma makes replenishes all your life energy and magic power. Your attack power also doubles until the first hit, first time you take damage. Now that is one hearty soup. And your kind old grandma filled your bottle so full that there's two helpings inside. Isn't she the sweetest? You and your sister love this soup, don't you? If you run out, I can make it for you anytime you like. Grandma's going to be going to try to be strong, so you try to be strong too. But don't you do anything reckless, all right? You know it really helps having a delay on the recording to uh, read it in case I almost miss it. Wait, oh, I didn't notice that we had water. My dear sweet Link, whenever you have an empty bottle, just bring it straight to Grandma. I can make more soup for you whenever you like. So yeah, basically, like she said, uh, she'll make soup for us anytime we want. But there is a glitch in Wind Waker that I'm going to be taking advantage of because it's just so good. Um, so basically what you do is you equip the soup to a button. Then you press the button that it's assigned to and start at the same time and then assign another button like the tinkle tuner to the same button that the soup was on then press start and Link will drink the soup and we still have two servings left I think Nintendo fixed this in the remake 
or in the H yeah I guess remake HD version port I don't know I don't really know if it's yeah I guess it's a port it's a remaster I don't know what and how I don't know how much work Nintendo did on it so yeah how many nice crusts do I have I don't think I have enough no I only have one one nice crust ah 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 Uh, oops. I'm gonna go back to the King of Red Lions. Real quick. Actually, that's weird I didn't get any... Red shoe jelly. Hmm. Oh, I got some mad... Oh yeah, the... I got hit. So the extra... Damage increase is gone. So, I th think that's it? I'm pretty sure that's it. Are you ready? I can't hear you. If that is the case, then we must search for the cave around the back side of Outset Island where Jaboon is said to hide. So... We're gonna go do that now. I'm pretty sure that's it. I really hope that's it. Because if that's not it, then, uh... I... must have forgotten. Ah! So now we have to... Um... Oh, we got the first part off. So we actually have to... Uh... Shoot this down. Oh, we already got the second one off. Huh. I mean, we have... Plenty of rupees and... Bombs grow in grass. Oh, that wasn't that bad. We might have a harder time doing it the first time I did. So. Oh, that's nice. He just takes us right in there, so I don't have to do anything. I can just be lazy and just commentate over the gameplay. I really like the water effects on the wall in here. It looks really nice. Well met, in, well met indeed, Jaboon. I am pleased to see that you are safe. Yes, seems that Ganon has returned. There can be no other explanation. Unfortunately, that is not so. The one I have brought with me has no connection to the legendary one. And yet I sense great promise in the courage that this one possesses. I do. It is the only way. Oh, that's weird how Link's face kind of pops up. You got Nehru's Pearl. The water spirit Jaboon was kind enough to give you this jewel, a treasure of one of the goddesses. You know, Jaboon, not even you can run forever. So that foul rain and endless night were indeed elements of a curse brought on us by Ganon. He must intend to cast this land into pure darkness for all time. The night shall last forever. I believe I have.
Ganon's curse has been broken by the power of the pearl that Jabun gave us, so morning should come soon. It is well that we have gathered all the pearls, so... That pearl exists... Did that pearl exist? If that pearl did not exist, that would explain why now it's morning. But if that pearl did exist, then... Why was it... Unless there was a like a magic seal that Jaboon put on there to protect the pearl from Ganon. Or if the pearl did exist and there was no magic seal, then it shouldn't have been night this entire time. So... I don't know. It is well that we have gathered all the pearls. I, I think I already read that. Are you ready, Link? I have marked the places where you must set the pearls on your sea chart. Once you have placed each of the pearls in its proper location, the proving grounds for your courage will become apparent. Clearly, the search for Jaboon has shown that Ganon has begun to make efforts to block our path forward. It is certain that the perils ahead will be greater than any you have faced thus far. You should finish any business you have here on Outset right now, so that you shall not have any regrets later. What if we go back in? You know, I remember reading about how... Oh, there's nothing in here. What if I get out and just swim out? You know, I remember reading about how there was supposed to be a water dungeon in Wind Waker. And... Oh, that's actually... Oh, no, I don't want to talk. Sorry. Uh, I remember reading about how there was a water dungeon that was supposed to be in Wind Waker. But... Uh, it was removed from the final game. And I don't think it was in the beta either. It was it was planned, but not implemented. So we used 20 bombs. That's fine. Alright, so... Did he put it on the C-chart? Yeah. So we're going to try to do that real quick. And then I can begin the dungeon in the next episode. So I'm going to go straight to those um wait no okay i'm going to i'm going to do this one then this one grab something here and then go back over to here so see you when i'm at the first one right here in episode I can't remember episode... Oh, it was episode 16 because episode 15 was like the Christmas special thing from uh, 2017 Christmas special. Kinda. Not really, but, you know. What island is that? Oh, that's kind of weird. I'll be getting there eventually. Probably. Oh, there's Beetle's Shop Shop. Anyway. Uh, in episode 16, I mentioned that there was something that I was looking into for my hair. To try to recover my hair, maybe, hopefully. Um, I've started to, uh, to take that, so I'm going to see in a few months how it works. I don't know if it'll help. Maybe, maybe not. I have no idea. But... Hopefully it helps, so that'll be nice. Wait, is it? Oh, I guess it's this island. I think I'm seeing two things right there. No, that's the... Oh, this is the, uh... Oh, it's a Great Fairy Island. I don't know which one, but it is one of them. Oh, I gotta do this. Oh, Link, get, Link got back in the water. Um. Nah. Well. There we go. 
We got blue true jelly, and that's all we need. Actually, nah. You know, blue true jelly is really not. It's really pointless, actually. When, um, that's nice to have hearts here. Uh, I'm so used to Breath of the Wild. Um, blue true jelly is kind of pointless when the soup exists. So, when the soup, and especially the soup glitch, exists. I think this one, oops, I think this gives us more bombs or something? I don't know. Sometimes the great fairies are a little disturbing, like... Four arms is a little disturbing, but not, eh, not that bad. I like the blue color, though. Oh yeah, this is a bomb bag upgrade. That's nice of them, of Nintendo's designers to change, or to make it so that we can do that easier. But yeah, anyway, I like the color gradient that the great fairies in this game have. Great fairies in this game actually are not that disturbing compared to some of the other ones. Yeah. So, oh, that explains why, why I thought this was the island we were supposed to go to. Well, that is nice though that the designers put, uh, or as some say, the architect, um, uh, puts stuff in the way that you're supposed to go. Ah, oh, it's morning again. It's still night here, though. But we're really close to where we need to go. I wonder where it is. I hope that's not it. Uh, where is it? Oh, we're not even in the square yet. I really like the uh, sailing music in Wind Waker. It gets kind of repetitive, but occasionally it's nice. Oh, it's this... Uh, oh, I didn't know that you could, uh... Keep the sail out while having other... Items equipped. I guess all the sail does is just... Is just for putting it up. That's literally all that you need the sail for. I really do not like those things. I I don't know what they are and I don't care. Oops. Uh oh yeah, Link can just jump up here. So this is the Nehru. The Nehru's Pearl one. Wandering traveler who seeks the guidepost of the goddesses. Place the pearl you hold here. It just pops into existence. Okay, so that's one done. You place Nehru's pearl in the ancient statue's hands. Two pearls remain. Dun dun. Ah! I was not expecting that. Uh, oh no. No. I need to get out of here. Huh. Oh, nice. Uh, the, I forgot that the bomb bag upgrades give you more bombs. Uh. 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 Okay, now we go straight up here. 
That was rough, but I guess it could be possible that those enemies are supposed to protect the statue to make sure that it doesn't fall into the wrong hands, just like I think I remember something about the guardians, the miniature guardians in the shrines in Breath of the Wild are supposed to protect shrine from anyone that's not linked in case someone somehow gets past the Sheikah Slate authentication plate thing in front of them. I don't know. It's really nice that the bomb bag upgrades give you refill your bomb bag for free so you don't have to go hunting for it. We're just gonna jump. Yeah, that was, um, that was, uh, not. I don't know what I'm trying to say. That was ineffective. Or, as some would say, it wasn't very effective. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Go, Link. Go. You can do it. Oh, it's gone now. Nice. Oh wait, it's back. Why is it back? It was just gone. I'm gonna go like that. Just in case. There's a fish. So we can get the map of this area and then uh, put the pearl in there. Um, so it's always good to have the maps filled in. I should go buy some more bait from Beetle next time I see him. Oh, there's the actor just sitting right there just going, Hi, Link! Let me tell you something, small fry. The school on that Woodfall Island has one gorgeous teacher. But the thing is, this gang of four little hoodlums is always causing trouble for it. These, those little delinquents like to cause all sorts of trouble. They go climbing trees and hiding behind buildings instead of going to school. What a bunch of savages. Somebody's got to scold those scoundrels and set them straight for the sake of that poor teacher. You hear me, Fry? And that's all the info I've got to offer. If you want to hear it again, you'll have to throw some more bait on the water for me. Sorry, but that's my policy, Fry. I can't go fighting evil on an empty stomach, you know. And with that, hasta la vista. Wait, where's the island? I... Um... It doesn't make any sense. Did I teleport or something? I sailed right past the island. Well, I guess that's what I get for...
trying to do an Arnold Schwarzenegger voice when for a character that it wouldn't make sense for. That's one way to outrun the water. Don't do that in real life though. Watching traveler who seeks the guideposts of the goddesses, place the pearl you hold here. This is Din's fire, or Din's... I can't remember. Din's fire is an Ocarina of Time. Oh, just Din's pearl. You place Din's pearl in the ancient statue's hands. One pearl remains. That was weird. It's kind of light out there. I'm, I'm gonna put a little arrow here in a screenshot. Show you what I saw over there. So I'm gonna go... I'm gonna go up to Windfall Island. And uh... Grab something. Head to the next island. And then we'll call that an episode. Okay, so now that we're back at Windfall Island, we gotta go talk to... Well, I remember that the character's name is Tot, but I don't remember the actual... The guy that says, thank you, thank you very much. Oh, Elvis. Yeah, that's Elvis. That magical dance that changes day into night, and night into day. If I could only recall the rhythm, oh, the rhythm, then I could dance it perfectly. I think we just do this twice. Yeah, we just do this twice. It's scripted. Un, un, cha, un, un, cha. That's, that's it. That's the rhythm I've been uh, trying to recall. Oh, I can feel it, guy. So, wait. Right, left, down. And that gets us. You learn the song of passing. That's it, that's it, and it's perfect. I'm perfect. Now let the sun shine on. Hey, what's the matter? Nothing happened? Nothing at all. Why? Because you're not chosen for it to work properly. Nah, I'm kidding. So now it will be daytime. I wish that this were possible in real life, that you could just play a song and then it'll magically be daytime or nighttime or whatever you need. I wish that it, w that it were that easy in real life, that you could just change it or whatever. Oh, we already have a new mail letter. We already have a new letter, yeah. Good morning. Letters for Link, we have one letter. Here's your letter. Thanks. Oh, this is Link's grandma. How are you doing, Link? Do you have enough of granny soup? Where are you now? I'm on Windfall Island, to be exact. You may be closer than I suspect. Uh, no. I'm almost the opposite end of the map. The only way I could be further away is if I was, like, in the northeast. Are you hungry? Are you keeping warm? You haven't injured yourself, have you? You always work so hard, Link. Do you have enough rupees? Your grandma doesn't have a lot, but I'm sending you everything I've saved up. Oh, I'm sorry. We wasted it. As long as I have you and Errol, I don't need anything else. I just want the two of you to return home safely. Love, Grandma. And we got a red rupee. That's that's nice, but I kind of feel bad because we wasted it. So anyway, uh, we've just learned the song of passing, so now things can be better because it'll be during the day. We're not Anything else that it could possibly mean, huh? Um, so we gotta, wait. I already forgot the Wind's Requiem. Wait. Oh, you can use the D-pad for that too. Anyway, I need to... Yeah, that's correct. So I need to point Link in that direction. See, what's nice about the Song of Passing is that 
It allows you to change it to daytime where there's actually music. To, you know, to listen to while you're sailing, you know? It just it actually makes it so much better. So I'm gonna go to that other island. Right there. See you then. Pretty much when I'm sailing, I just leave the controller there and just sit there. It's nice how... Oh, it's raining now. It's nice how in the Wii U version there's a swift sail, so you can sail faster. And then, um... But the only problem with the GameCube version is it loads. Apparently they were gonna try that, but it uh, caused issues caused issues with the map loading, so they didn't. Oh, that was weird. That one flickered. Literally unplayable. The uh, thing over there flickered in and out. That's, like I said, that's literally unplayable. Ah. So here's... Oh wait, no, that's not the fish. I thought it was a little well away from an island for the fish to be out here, but I was like, yeah, it's close. it looks like a fish. No. Is that a fish? No, I don't think so. That It's going to be like, it's kind of like that one. Um, is this a... I don't know. I don't actually know the original name. It's where that one guy's going like, is this a thing with a pointing out a butterfly that he thinks is something else? Okay, so it's up here. I thought I saw something blowing up in the sky. In video games, that means that's valuable. But in real life, that means, I don't know. Yeah, it's a beacon. It looks like a beacon in there. I'm not going to get that yet, because that could be... Um... That could be something... That could be like a large rupee or something. So here's the final one. Wandering traveler who seeks the guideposts of the goddesses, place the pearl you hold here just pops into existence like the other two did and now it starts glowing you place Ferrar's pearl in the ancient statue's hands now we watch a cutscene this is a nice place to end the episode after after the episode after this will end it Oh yeah, great idea, Link. Let's get really close to the statue. And this uh, thing rising out of the sea is something important that I'm not sure when they... Oh, that looks painful. I don't know when they actually describe what this is, but it's nice that I assume they put you right next to it. Oh yeah, the King of Red Lion sails right over to you. And I think picks you up too. Magnificent, isn't it? It's actually, I really like that music. I really like how magnificent, grand it feels. This tower, which the pearls of the gods have caused to appear, is a place that the gods of the ancient world prepared so that they might test the courage of men. 
Only one who is able to overcome the trials that await here will be acknowledged by the gods to be a true hero. Only then will that hero be permitted to wield the power to destroy the great evil. Link, that which you must obtain now lay lies before you. You must believe in your own courage, which has led you to triumph over the many hardships you have faced, and you must triumph once again. You must rise above the trial of the gods. Let's go! But... I'm afraid that this is where our journey in this episode ends. In the next episode, what we're going to do is go into the Tower of the Gods. Oh, that's weird. It, huh. You turn the boat when you're looking around. That's interesting. Goodbye for now.